Howdy doody everybody, my name is Kev Gooey and welcome back to Nano Kami the Two Princess Knights of Kyoto Part 2. あ、明日に。また、ここで必ず一人で来て。私と会ったことは誰にも言わないでね。ああ。うん。オッケー。え?ちょっと。ルカ。ああ。Well, he darts back into the thicket about as fast as Haku did back at the Imperial Palace. The only traces left of her are her footprints in the soaked ground. No me not to tell anyone, but I need to make sure Shino knows at the very least. Yeah. That's the most important person that, you know, to know about this. Ah, so you know. So you know you could join me, right? Oh, look what you did, Len. Yeesh, we've got a toughie on our hands here. I think she's still crying, and I just realized the TV. It does it. <laughs> it's onus. Huh. Huh. Hmm. It, it, it reminds me of a, of, of a, you know, brand that, uh, I know. You know. Oh man. Can't tell her then. Ooh, I wonder if, uh, if Uzume is going to be sleeping with Len. Oh, there you go. This house is pretty large, but there aren't any spare rooms. Oh, good question. I didn't have time to think about that considering how sudden things went. Yeah, yeah. She's definitely going to be sleeping on the floor, huh? Are you sure? I don't think you uh, understand the situation, uh, Len. You can leave your luggage here, Luzume. That's the first time I've seen someone get so excited over TV. I've got a huge doggy jumping around right next to me, funnily enough. I follow her eyes to the triangular robotic vacuum. Might as well turn it on. Ah. <laughs> uh, the oversized frightened doggy jumped right at me after the vacuum wars to life. Oh boy, she's gonna have a pretty uh, exciting time uh, adjusting to this world. It's a vacuum cleaner that works on its own. I actually meant to get one for your place, but I for completely forgot. <sighs> Oh, she's on her. 
I'm pretty sure she doesn't care. Yep. I can't blame anyone but myself. Well, I think it's safe to say I can leave Uzume in your hands, Lenchan. Anyway, I should take a bath. I can tell Uzume about Ruka after that. Oh, they weren't gonna have a bad time. Oh. ちょっと寒いくらいかもしれませんいえ寒いのでレンちゃんが温めてくださいいえあのね今こっついたら暑いでしょ What? That was convenient. I sense a presence leaving her room. Oh, here we go. そう言ってどうするの。うずめからもルカ本人からも事情は聞いたよ。うん。とりあえずルカは大丈夫。無事だよ。なんか急いでたみたいで、あんまり話できなかったけど。よかった。明日夜にまた戻ってくるって。あ
ちょっとだけ暑いかなそんな無理して着なくていいのにそういえばみつるぎさんがおじいちゃんたちの真剣を持ってきたよ形見だってさ Oh yeah ごめんね私は見殺しにああそういうことじゃないよあんたはあんたの事情があったんでしょ言い訳はできないよ私がやってきたことはしーちゃんたちが守るべき人たちに危害を加えることでももう私を縛っていた枷は外れた誰にも信用してもらえないだろうけどこれからは私がしーちゃんを守る剣になる Oh yes you did I'm gonna end the episode here, everybody, because oh, it's gonna be a big, big thing in the next episode with Ruka telling her about all of everything that the Suju Mikado san has done and what she did to him. I think, I hope. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you guys did, then please slime that like button and subscribe down below for more awesome videos. Thank you, everybody, for watching this episode, and you will hear me in the next one. Goodbye!